Anything that catches his eye, I stop. So we were kind of up on the hill over here to the right. And there's all these uh, like separated ponds here. Um, can't see very well from where we're at, but basically it looks like that. And so he wanted to see what's going on. They're actually giving tours inside this. already inside. I've got this pretty cool pool here. Lots of little fish in there. So okay, we're gonna go and see what he's up to. I guess they've been out harvesting fish. So I'm gonna explain this stuff to you. So this is the breeding grounds. I love the smell. Got a lot of feathers in there. And some of them are hatching, some of them on the other side are hatching out. Well, let, let's go around there, Granddaddy. Keep on going, follow. You do what you gotta do, huh? Thank you. To the left. Wow. The uh, eggs on the other side they're are hatching out. They're uh, 24 hours older. They're hatching a little bit more. You can see them more swimming around. Then after they hatch, they come out of here, go down this pipe, and they come up over there in that first tank with the light on. You can see what the little ones look like after they're uh, Okay. And on this side they're, they're hatching one. Let's go around to this side. So I hate this because I doubt very seriously you can see them, but there's literally a little teensy fish in there. Where are they little fish? They're swimming yeah. around. 
You're swimming around on the outside of that tube? Yeah. I'm swimming around in there. You see all that stuff there? Yeah. Those are eggs. Okay. And then the fish are hatching, and I guess they go up and they get put in this tube and they go over to this place over here. Oh. So those fish over here are obviously older than these. But look at all these eggs. These are all fish eggs. I know you can see those. You just oh, can't. Yeah. You just can't see the fish. Wow. So that's okay. They're in there. They're little, microscopic. Pretty neat. That represents a lot of fish. <laughs> well, I'm gonna ask him. Excuse me, sir. How many fish are we looking at here in this? Uh, these, uh, these are walleye eggs, and there's uh, about 3,048 eggs per ounce, and there is about 11 ounces in one ounce, one inch. So that's 30. So that That's 36,000. So uh, like a jar like this probably has about 120,000 fish in it. 120,000 fish. Thank you. And if you go over there, you can, you, he should be able to see They were that. a little small over there. Uh, he went over there? Over no, there. no, I'm saying these on this side here were a little small. But they're down this way. Small, I guess, but there's just a lot more of them. Let's go down this way. What's with the feathers? That's what we use to stir them up. Oh, okay. Turkey feathers. This way, Granddaddy. We're going. I do. They're in there. They're... Yeah, I think I see them. <laughs> yeah, they're small. They're about as big as a gnat. Right now there's about 500,000 in that thing. 500,000 fish in there. Wow. That's pretty awesome. Alrighty. There's their stir sticks. Hey, here's our campsite. I wonder what the Clear Creek Recreation Area Cave Run Lake Daniel Boone National Forest right Clear Creek, Clear Creek Recreation Area Daniel Boone National Forest right outside of Cave Run Lake so here's what we got pit toilets for granddaddy which work out this works out great I don't know if you can see it but over here uh, right over there somewhere there's a post a green one and there's water 
So here we go. There's my Mabel. I think the heat's getting to Granddaddy. It's 70. And I think the heat's getting to him. That's a little scary. Town to us I'm not sure. Huh? I don't know. Yeah, I don't have a map. You got a Kentucky map? You all right? Yeah. <laughs> oh. I was gonna go get us, or we could go get something to drink. Oh. Well, yeah. If it wasn't too far, I don't want to go 20, 30 miles. I think it's about 10 miles or so, and I, well, I didn't... 10 miles, not too bad. Yeah. Yeah. I just wondered uh, if it's a wet county, well... Well, what do you, what do you think about this spot? Do it's, you, a, it's fine. Do you remember the name of it? Not really. No. I think it was Clear... Cl Clear Creek? Clear Creek, that's right. Yep, Clear, that's Clear it. That, that's what it is. Clear Creek. And we're right outside of Cave Run Lake. We were at Clear Creek in Colorado. Clear, Clear Creek. Creek. Yeah. Clear, it's Clear Lake, though. Clear Lake, yep, that's right. When we went up 12,000 feet to go fishing. That's right. Yeah. yeah. I caught a fish. Yeah, you sure did. Yeah, right off the bat. Yeah, you sure did. No shame you didn't get, catch one. That's the mission tomorrow. I have a mission tomorrow. We're going to catch you a fish. Is that, is it okay somehow, way, shape, or form? If I catch one of any size, it's going to go in the frying pan. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, we, we need to catch you one. That's, that's what we need to do. Okay. Sun setting over here. Frogs are starting to come out. Grenade's looking tired. Look at what all the poor people are doing. Probably <laughs> thankful that the weather is warm. Better, but that's still not it. Okay, zip me up and I'll be all right. There I go. Thank yeah. you. Good night. <laughs> Good night, Granddaddy. What? Have you got the fire going? I was going to see if I could have a drink of this. Oh. Cold. What? Cold. <laughs> it's not cold. 65 degrees. Damn, it don't feel like a 65. Feels like... 25. Yeah, okay. Busy. Busy place. See what you got in your bag. Yeah, I see. Got six beers. Six beers, but there's some bourbon in there too. Oh, little bottles. Yeah. Little bottles. Early times. Southern Comfort. I'll be damned. Yeah. I didn't see those. That's cute. Yeah. 
Yeah. Real neat. Told you you're sleeping. We're on our way to White Sulphur Horse Camp. a jump off spot for horseback riders. I don't know what the name of this place is. I forgot it. I, I think I may have said it earlier in the video, but here we are set up with the, probably one of the better setups that we've had. So got to utilize the awning, have it tied to the table. It's pretty genius. Yeah. Yeah, this is great. How you like me now? Yeah. Anyway, what else we got here? We got uh, what is it? I didn't. What? You have a little slip. You are. What do you got? What do you got there? Kentucky. I think it's ginger ale. You told me. Kentucky ale. Yeah, uh, ginger ale made in Kentucky. Yeah, that's, you it? Really what do you think about your new hat? I'm not a big fan. It's a little flimsy, but it's two things that I'm not a big fan of. What? Camouflage and orange. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know, whatever. Your hat. So here we go. This is what the campsite looks like. I got a real good feeling that uh this thing kind of blows in the wind. I might actually anchor this. You see, it makes for pretty good setup here. The first couple times that I went to Colorado, I went obviously without a trailer. I mean, I had the trailer, but I just didn't pull it out there. And I, I used this tarp. And so I usually slept in the back of the Jeep, which you know to me that works out good but uh, this tarp is fantastic it buys you space if it's raining or the weather turns foul and um, it really just uh, pretty nice yeah it's pretty nice shade that's the biggest thing shade there's the uh, trailer stocked up Bought Grande a six pack of beer because he didn't sleep very well last night. I also got him some bourbons, but I don't know that he's going to be getting into those. So, now this is rather interesting because <laughs> we've been here 10 minutes. Granddaddy. Yeah. Come and look at this. What is it? Well, I don't know who I'm kidding. I don't know if you can see this, but I don't like this much at all. So I haven't set this stuff down here, but for 10 minutes, maybe. But there is literally a bazillion. In fact, we're going to do something about it. What is it? Can you see all those spiders on there? Those are all spiders. Oh. I mean, there's thousands of them on Damn. there. Damn. That's going. Thousands of them. This this has not been here but for just a minute. God, I hope we didn't track all those damn things. Eleven forty-five. Now, <laughs> oh, 
all about some hippies, but seriously, man, there's a bus of them. <laughs> there's a freaking bus load of hippies. Yeah, it's called a schoolie. And there is a schoolie in the campground that just rolled up like a bat out of hell. These kids are partying. I don't know how much you can see. That's what we got. Kids are partying. This is gonna make for an interesting night. Right, Daisy girl? We've been invaded by hippies. I might put the hearing aids on. All right. Yeah. All right. Let me see. Did they go to bed? I thought they went to bed about midnight. Awesome. <laughs> you guys, take care.
It's a good, it's a good stuff here. I've done that trip a couple times. It's fun. Longer than it seems. To give that rod, I can't see where it's going. 